Indian Eyes originated from the uh, University of Bristol uh, School of Physics. Um, we started off by making some novel uh, cantilever sensors for various types of research we were doing over the last five to ten years. We started making novel cantilever based sensors uh, at the University of Bristol over the last five to ten years. Um, and in gaining that experience we realised we were ideally placed to um, start a company to commercialise uh, our work. Uh, so we formed New Nano uh, and we're the first uh, UK sub supplier of AFM probes for mainstream applications. So the AFM probe consists of uh, a cantilever and a tip. Um, the cantilever characteristics define the mechanical properties of the, of the probe uh, and the tip obviously that contacts the surface uh, and interacts uh, with the surface. So obviously one of the key components of the AFM probe is the tip. And ideally, the sharper the tip, the, the higher the resolution image you can obtain. Um, so we're producing tips that are typically five nanometers uh, in radius, uh, and we're inspecting every single probe before they get shipped out. So AFM probes are made using fairly standard microfabrication processes. So you start off with a photolithography step uh, and then various thin film depositions or etching processes uh, in a particular order you want to make your final structure. So we want to make sure that all of our tips uh, meet the spe specification expected by the customer. So we inspect 100% using scanning electron microscopy. Okay, so the processes we were using um, as part of our research were giving us really good reproducibility and we just that gave us the confidence to start. So New Nano is a member of um, Set Squared Business Acceleration Centre, which is the University of Bristol's business incubator. We're housed down at Engine Shed in the Temple Mead Station, which is a larger um, environment for high-tech startup innovation, um, specifically focusing on Bristol and Bath tech sectors. Being part of Set Squared and Engine Shed. Um, Means we're surrounded by some like-minded people trying to start their own companies, uh, from some hardware-based but more software. Uh, but everyone's going through the same experience. It's great for bouncing ideas off each other and learning what you need to learn to start a successful business. I think the most difficult thing at the start is to get the market aware of your presence and your and the products. Um, we've been quite fortunate having close ties to universities in the UK, so we now have several universities using our products and that's growing every day. High speed non-contact imaging to add living, on living cells is what we're trying to do in this lab uh, which is in the Nanoscience and Quantum Information building in the basement in one of the quietest places in the world. Um, this this uh, slab that the whole uh, apparatus is sitting on uh, and there we hear the air jacks readjusting um, to, to keep the slab level, uh, produces uh, the, the, the quietest, lowest vibration environment um, anywhere in the world. This is a um, prototype made by Rob Hardiman during his PhD of the high-speed uh, vertical, vertical probe microscope. So most AFMs are, use a cantilever that's almost horizontal. In this case, the cantilever is completely vertical, perpendicular to the sample. And this allows us to approach the sample and uh, sense it through the water structure before we touch it. So we put essentially zero force on the sample, allowing us to look at very delicate samples and not influence processes that might be occurring, say, on a cell membrane. So our goal is to use this microscope, which is a high-speed version, um, to image the surface of cells. 
probes that we use in here are highly specialized. They need to have particular mechanical properties to sensitivity, but also the high resonant frequencies. And these are made for us um, by New Nano.